at this stage, you know, we were we were close. I think the, the 90 minutes we played, 95 minutes we played, we were outstanding, I think. We put them under pressure, we won it. I think everything happened that we wanted, um, created good chances. The only thing was they had a quite a goal, good goalkeeper in, in, in their team, so uh, that's also part of football. When you look at the game, it was such a good performance, especially that second half of normal time. You created so much against a very good side. How encouraging is that, even though you're disappointed now, you can look back and say, well, we did plenty in this game to try and win. Yeah, but we know we, we, we have that quality. We know we have been doing it all season. You know, uh, I think people forget those things pretty quickly if, if, if things are not going well for a couple games. But, you know, that's that's the reality too with, with how people look at us. We have been outstanding the whole season. And we have to just keep doing what we're doing. Um, it's not easy, but um, yeah, the, the thing now is just to make sure that we uh, we will be ready for for a very tough game on Monday. You win and lose as a team. What have the boys said to Adrian? Because I'm guessing he will be disappointed. His reaction at the, the goal they scored initially. He was disappointed. Yeah, what you said. You know, you win, you win and lose together. That's that's the message that we we always have. So you know, there's no one to to blame and look at. We all do it together. And that's that's the mentality we have, so there's nothing to worry about. And finally, I don't have disappointment tonight, but the perfect game on the horizon to pick yourselves up and go again with a, a derby to move you closer to the Premier League tonight. Yeah, well, you know, everyone wants to play that game. It's going to be a very tough game, big challenge, and uh, something that we all should enjoy. But for now, obviously, we make sure we we recover and uh, you know get our heads up again because you know we uh, we didn't lost, lose here for a long, long time. But, you know, this it happened. Thanks, Roger. Roger, what was the emotion like in that dressing room when you all went in afterwards? Did, did you speak? Not a lot, but you know, the manager obviously spoke a bit, and uh, obviously, what everyone can expect is that everyone is disappointed. Um, no one wants to get out of the competition. No one wants to get out of the competition, especially the way we play as well tonight, when we had opportunities. Um, but yeah, it's reality. We're out of it, and we have to deal with it. We have to. Go again. So, in terms of between now and the end of the season, obviously it's only the Premier League. Only you've got now. No, you, you, I mean okay. no other competitions. We know how important the Premier League is. But what I'm saying is, do you now raise the bar and remind everybody how excellent you've been, and then you set it for futures? Yeah, well, the thing is, um, <laughs> what I just said, like we know how we have been performing throughout the whole season, and we won't take that for granted. And what other people say from the outside when things are not going well for two or three games. You know, it's not it's not a problem, you know, everyone can, can have their opinion. But we don't need to forget that we have been unbelievable the whole season, basically. And obviously we we wish to be in all competitions still, but we're not. But we are I don't know how many points now, twenty five points, but obviously City has a game in hand, top of the league. And uh we should be positive. But, you know, that's the obviously difficult at this point because we, we lost tonight. We're out of the competition of the Champions League, and, but we will we'll, we'll focus back on, on on that from from when we're back in on Friday. Because you can smash records now, can't you? You can't just win the title. You can break records. You can blow records out of the water. Is that important at all now? We want to win the league. That's the that's the main target. And whether that happens when you when you when you smash records, then obviously there's a bonus. But it's all about winning it. And we were very close last year. We are very close this year, and we just have to go for it. And uh, until it's actually done, then we will see where we uh, where we are. No worry. Uh, tell me quickly your uh, reaction after that uh, defeat, with a big match today with Atletico. Disappointed. You know, no one wants to uh, get out of the Champions League. So, uh, but yeah, it happened. So we uh, we congratulate Atletico Madrid and uh, wish them luck. Do you think you, the, the legs were a little bit tired after the, the game with all the congestion fixtures in the Premier League, in the FA Cup, in the Champions League? No. Do you think so? I don't know. Did you saw anything of, of tiredness in the first 90 minutes? No? Okay. Then no. we were not tired at all. We were ready for the game. We played, I think, fantastic the first 90 minutes. Um, 95, you know, scoring the goal that we needed. And unfortunately, the things happened the way things happened. With the solution now in the team, uh, are confident now finish this uh, season strong in the Premier League. Uh, what do you think of this topic of the coronavirus? 
We're gonna fix. You think the Premier League? You want to see the stadiums empty, maybe? No one wants to see the stadium empty, but it's not my decision. Um, we have to follow procedures that the the government and then the people that goes and decides what happens. So we'll see what happens. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, thank you.